AI and Gen AI in particular are top of mind for many security practitioners as well as threat actors. VMware vDefend has long been at the forefront of the AI and ML innovation journey, which includes the use of AI for micro-segmentation rule recommendation and applying machine learning to correlate atomic threat events into prioritized and actionable threat campaigns with network detection and response, or NDR, part of the advanced threat prevention offering. Now we have released Intelligent Assist for vDefend, powered by Gen AI. This new capability simplifies the way infrastructure, network security, and SOC teams understand threats and their impact. With a few clicks, security practitioners can initiate the proper remediation without any network changes or complex workflows. Intelligent Assist democratizes threat response and enables infrastructure and security teams to operate far more collaboratively to defend against complex ransomware attacks. Here you can see that through network detection and response, we've detected a couple of high-impact multi-stage attacks and correlated them into a campaign. When we open up the highest priority campaign, we can see it includes detections from IDPS, malware and anomaly detection involving multiple threats and workloads, and we've mapped those to the MITRE attack framework. As you can see, we've correlated the execution of malware with lateral movement, command and control, collection and exfiltration. To learn more about this campaign, we can click our Intelligent Assist icon here. Let's ask our Intelligent Assist to explain the campaign. As you can see, based on all the events that make up the campaign and context about the environment, a number of hypotheses are provided that describe what happened. It's clear that we had some type of Trojan activity followed by lateral movement and data exfiltration. Let's ask more about the exfiltration activity. Now we can see that the data was first staged from our internal file server to a VDI desktop with internet access and then exfiltrated to an external IP address. We can also use one of the suggested prompts to learn more about the tools and techniques the attacker used, such as Cobalt Strike, or we can also type custom commands like what are the indicators of compromise. Intelligent Assist also has the ability to remediate a threat. For that, let me switch over to our IDS and IPS event view. I see a couple of critical events here, so I'm opening up this one, which indicates Trojan activity related to Cobalt Strike on this workload. Again, I'm going to launch my Intelligent Assist Copilot, and this time I'm going to ask how this threat can be remediated. I can choose from a number of different strategies, and I'm choosing the comprehensive strategy. As you can see, a remediation policy is proposed, and I can go ahead and create a policy. This will create and publish the appropriate security groups, IDPS policy and rules to deal with the Trojan activity we had identified and block it. I can now go to my IDPS policy and under our emergency section, you can see Intelligent Assist has automatically published this remediation policy. I can now go ahead and enable it and this will automatically block this malicious Cobalt Strike Trojan network activity.